Welcome to the instructional video on using Romex Tras bedding products. We'll guide you step by step to ensure professional results when laying tiles or slabs. Romex Tras bedding is a highly water permeable, frost resistant bedding mortar with Tras minerals that bind the lime particles in Portland cement, reducing the risk of waterlogging, efflorescence, and discoloration. In combination with Romex adhesion elutriant and jointing mortars, it offers a long-lasting solution to prevent rutting, settlement, and displacement. Romex Tras bedding comes ready to use and requires mixing with local aggregate number 9 stone and water. It is suitable for both private and commercial areas, including outdoor spaces equipped with snow melting and de-icing systems. For mixing, you will require a gravity cement mixer, or for small batches a clean mortar tub, and a sufficiently powered mixing paddle. Common tools such as a shovel, trowel, quarter of an inch notch trowel, will barrow, and screed pipes will be needed during the application. Important, the substrate must be prepared in accordance with all relevant permeable standards. Ensure that water drainage is accounted for, especially for non-permeable substrates, by using filter layers, drain holes and adequate slopes. Expansion joints must also be accounted for and installed according to the building physics requirements. To prepare Romex Tras bedding, mix approximately 10 liters of cold water for 25 kilo respectively 55 pound bag of Tras compound, for equivalent parts of one quarter of an inch clean aggregate in a clean vessel using a mixer for 3 to 4 minutes. The mix should be slightly moist, similar to damp earth, and ready for immediate use. The correct consistency is achieved when the mixture can be formed into a compact ball with a slight sheen. For Romex Elutrian Thin Set, Bonding Slurry, add the material into a clean vessel slash bucket, then mix with cold water using a paddle mixer for 3 minutes. The water quantity will depend on the quantity required. Typically. 5 liters per 25 kilo respectively 55 pound bag will suffice for notched trowel application. For dipping smaller stones, increase the water to 6 liters per bag. After mixing, allow the slurry to rest for 2 minutes before stirring again. Spread the mixed Romex Tras bedding onto the prepared substrate using a pipe or screed gauge to create a layer 4 to 10 cm respectively 1.5 to 4 inches thick, depending on the load requirements. Apply Romex Elutrian Thin Set to the clean dust-free, dry underside of the tile or slab using a notched trowel. Position the tile or slab at the correct height, ensuring a strong bond by tapping it into place. Be sure to leave about 1 cm respectively half an inch to prevent oozing and maintain the drainage capacity of the joints. For smaller tiles, immerse the slightly moist, clean tiles or slabs about 2 to 3 cm respectively 3 quarter inch up to 1 inch deep into the bonding slurry to ensure a strong connection between the two layers. If you lift a tile or slab after setting, you will clearly see the strong bond between the slurry and bedding, providing excellent surface stability and load-bearing capacity. Once the tiles or slabs are laid, protect the surface from excessive sun or rain. After 24 hours, lightly spray the surface with water. The area must not be subjected to load until the bedding mortar has fully cured and reached the necessary strength. 7 days pedestrian 14 days vehicular by using romex tras bedding in compliance with the relevant standards you ensure dimensional stability and load bearing capacity of the paved surface additionally you are eligible for the romex system guarantee for more information visit www.romexhardscapes.com